Hey, uh, Asgore? Yes? I was reading the book, and it said skeletons are good at color magic. Blue magic, right? That can't be right. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's why I wanted to ask. What do you mean, that can't be right? Skeletons can't use blue magic. It's bad. Yeah, that definitely can't be right. Is everything in this book true? Why is blue magic bad? It's bad because... It... Why is it bad? I don't know. It just is. Isn't it? It's bad magic. If you use it, you'll get hurt. You're never supposed to use it, no matter what. No! Where did you get that idea? Skeletons used blue magic for all sorts of good things. They used it to help monsters who were stuck, or hold their children, or help the elderly, or... Could you use it to hurt someone? You have discovered! Asgore, quick! Where's Wingding? Oh, where is he run off to now? You... You killed my family. I'll kill you! My child, are you all right? I'm sorry. Are you all right? Come on, let's go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I couldn't. I didn't know what to do. Well, all magic can be used to hurt someone, but that doesn't mean it has to hurt someone. It all depends on how it is used. Next time we spar papyrus, you can turn my soul blue, and you will see that it is completely harmless. Trust me. Well, if you say so, but only a little, okay? Of course. You'll see. There's nothing to be afraid of. You're doing wonderfully, Papyrus. You have a real aptitude for this. Uh, are you sure? I don't know. I am definitely sure. Mm. It's been like this since it happened. I think he's still in shock. It must have been his first. Has he not said anything to you? No. Not a word. Do you think you could try to talk to him? He might respond to you. Hmm. You see, blue magic is no more dangerous than any other kind of magic. Ooh, and not every monster can use color magic, you know. In a way, it makes you special. Sort of like a special attack? Greetings, my child. Wingdings, isn't that right? How are you feeling? I know that you've been through a great deal lately. Especially with what just happened. Yes, that's a good way to think of it. You can even lift me over your bullets yourself if you think I'm having trouble. It can help people, just like I said. Uh, right. Right, nothing bad's happening. Nothing bad. Um, 
uh, s sorry. I'm still, uh, a, a little t tiny bit nervous, even though, even though I don't think you're lying or anything. Uh, uh. There is no need to apologize. You're not doing anything wrong. It's all right to be afraid sometimes. It's all right. You do not have to speak. May I please share something with you? You know, I remember how I felt when I first killed someone. But the more you use it, the less scary it will be. Do you remember how you felt when you first turned me blue? Uh-huh. And now it doesn't seem as scary, does it? I... I guess it doesn't. I didn't think about it like that. I was attacked, and I feared for my life, just as you did. I remember when it happened, feeling as though the axe shattered my soul. But instead of disappearing, it reformed in an instant. Stronger than before, but different. Some parts of it were cold, numb, like a scar. And I knew that I had changed. Something in me was different. And I could not go back. When I had to fight again, it was easier than before to... It will get easier and easier each time you use it. You'll see. You don't have to stop being afraid all at once. Just one step at a time. It's not something to do carelessly, or thoughtlessly, but... What you are going through, you are not alone. Do you understand what I mean? I know that I cannot take away your pain. I'll try. It's hard, though. I know, but you are very brave, Papyrus. But please, believe me when I say that they would have wanted you alive. I want you alive. And as long as I am with you, I will do my best to protect you, so you won't have to do such things again. I promise. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you can conquer this, and I'll do my best to help you along the way. Yeah, 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 I think I can too. Thanks. Papyrus, can you get the cinnamon for me? Sure. What do you need it for? I'm baking something. Cinnamon isn't very good on spaghetti. I'm not making spaghetti. Uh. You do know there is food other than spaghetti, right? And now for an Isabella Manalis comic dub. Please subscribe. Sweet. Hot pockets are done. What? All right, where are you hiding this time, Editon? You rang? I'm gonna need you to stop coming in my house. I wanna do that too. Smile. Oh my. Let's go, darling. Smile, Zombie. Hey, I need your help. Can you come here? Well, I can't. I'm buying clothes. All right, hurry up and come over here. Well, I can't find them. What do you mean you can't find them? I can't find them. There's only spaghetti. What do you mean there's only spaghetti? It means there's only spaghetti. Then get out of the spaghetti aisle. All right, you don't have to shout at me. There's more spaghetti. What do you mean there's more spaghetti? In there's just more spaghetti. Go into the next aisle. There's more spaghetti. Where are you right now? I'm at spaghetti. What do you mean you're at spaghetti? 
It mean I'm at spaghetti. What store are you in? The spaghetti store. Why are you buying clothes at the spaghetti store? Leave me alone. Frisk, I heard you want to know how to make a good pun. Not I never again. said that. That's great. Then Please to get you started, no. how about She's a really quick going for it. tutorial? Oh my hey, god. You guys like it. <laughs> yes, let me reset. Please. Please. Oh my god, Frisk, who gave you a fake gun? Hand it to me. I can't believe someone would allow such a thing. Let's give you something more appropriate. Here you go, darling. Much better. You'll be safe now, you hear? Toodles! Uh, please spare me, Frisk. You two are learning so fast. Is it alright if I ask you some things? Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, I think so too. Well, first, what are your names? What's a name? You... Hmm. Well, a name is what people call you. My name is Asgore, for example. Asgore? Yes, that's right. Uh, then my name is Brother. Yes, that's my name too. That's what my brother calls me. Oh, well, that's not... Those aren't really names, exactly. But that's all we've been called. No one has ever called you anything else? Nuh-uh. Have you ever spoken to anyone else? Besides me? Uh... No, not that I remember. What's the last thing either of you remember? Uh... You finding us, I think. Yeah! That's the last thing I remember, too! Maybe you two have amnesia? That might explain it. What about those things on your hands? Do you remember anything about those? Nuh uh. Uh, maybe these are our names? So, my name is WDG1S, I guess. Then, I'm WDG2P! No, no, those aren't proper names. Especially not for skeletons. Why not? When I talk, you can see my words, right? Uh huh. Then here. Look through the book. What do my words look like? Um. Let's see. Oh! Oh, brother, look! There are your words! Huh? That's what your words look like! Right there! Oh, really? This says it's Comic Sans. What do I look like? Let's see. Uh, yeah, here it is. Yours look like this. Pup. Papyrus? You know, what do you two think about using those as names? Comic Sans? And Papyrus? I think they suit you. <laughs>